welcome fellows for this video we will unbox one of my new electrical uh, testing instrument so i ordered this one online for a very reasonable price so thank you for the seller and thank you for the company products so just a little disclaimer i am not sponsored by any of this company i decided to make a unboxing video of my new electrical instrument so let's go let's unbox this so let's start unboxing and see what is inside of this uh, very big box so it's very protected so this is what we have inside a curiosity clamp meter model 2007R so for this video we will be focusing on what is the main specification of this uh, clamp meter so about a true RMS so what is a true RMS means so we will not be focusing on taking voltage and uh, resistance so we will be focusing on this video about the true RMS the special specifications of this clamp meter so let's open this one so let's start opening this box So this is what we have inside the leather case of this uh, new Kyoritsu 2007R. So we have the test lid and we have the unit uh, itself. So it's very nice, uh, shock, uh, shock proof. And then we have the instruction manuals and then we have the battery so we will try to put now our battery so we will check our new Kyoritsu 2007 R with a special feature of true RMS So let's have a little comparison between my old one and my new one. If you will see, our old one has a selector of 400 amperes and 600 amperes, while the new one is what we call the outer rings up to 1000 amperes. And then if we will move our selector here, we are already on the ammeter, while the other one is located here. And then if you will see the old one we have three uh, termin three connector for our test probe so we have here the common and for the voltage and for the ohmmeter while our new one we are only having here the common and the combination of voltmeter and ohmmeter so the other one the, the old one also we don't have uh, DC voltmeter while the new one is we have the DC voltmeter so what we are going to do now is we will check the difference of their reading with ammeter so we will try some of our uh, three phase induction motor here and let's see what is there the difference between their uh, reading so let's check so this time we will be trying to get the actual uh, ampere reading of our uh, three phase induction motor so we will be checking only this line just to make the comparison so we will try to put our new Kyoritsu 2007R with true RMS and the other one I think there is no uh, there is nothing labeled on this clamp meter as true RMS so we will be checking what is their difference so let's start 
check taking our uh, actual current by using this uh, one clamp meter this is also Kyoritsu so but on this uh, on this Kyoritsu there is no label uh, true RMS so we will check what is the difference between uh, with true RMS and uh, with non uh, true RMS so what we got here we will uh, make it close so we are getting the reading of 175 ampere so we will uh, check by using our new Koritsu so what is their difference so in our uh, new Koritsu with true RMS we are getting reading of 178 while on the other we are only getting 175 amperes